TV is your voice sensitive. Okay, so today I'm going to show you how you can redeem for your Microsoft voucher, right? So, first of all, open the mail that you use for the registration, and that mail after you are done with your training, then they will send you a link for you to get registered for the um, the voucher, right? So, first of all, after um opening this they will tell you are you certified and they will show you the steps that you have to take through before you can do it right so just click on exam details okay so you just click on this and come to schedule so you just read from here so from there click to view the exam details then you come to take the schedule exam so just click this one and schedule for the exam so um so just wait good so you have to fill some information here so some information here right so um mr Press uh, save and continue. Accept. So after this is done, then you will you will okay. So we are done. So just have to click on continue. On. Just click on continue. On. good so they are saying that no available discounts right no available discount there is no so this is what you have to do the email that you use for the registration this is a trick the email that you use for the registration kindly type it here that's the only email that can help you get the voucher the discount right Then click on check legibility. I see we have email you a verification then the name. So just go to your email. So just go to your email. The email that is used for the registration. Guys, okay, so they have now sent me the mail but you know something i reached for about let's say 30 minutes before they send the distance so i pause the video right so just copy it and paste it here then verify so let's see what happens good right good so now your you see this is very perfect so now you see they are giving you the voucher right 
so i say uh, a microsoft training day right attendance so you can claim the voucher and you can book for the exams right so when is it expiring that's next year uh february right so next year february 26th so even if you fail the exam 10 times you are going to write it you are going to write this until you pass and this uh, voucher will only expire at this time right so this is a good opportunity for you to learn and pass so you, when you feel for the first time that's fine you you go back to the resources and i'm not saying it's, no one is going to fail right and even if you feel you have the chance of writing it again so let's see how you can claim it so just click on claim and it will be written claimed right then you schedule for the exams right so this is it guys it's very simple <laughs> this is not a work of science okay so let me show you how to schedule for the exams i think that one is very important so for this one you just have to um so uh, okay so you just have to choose this one choose this one and uh this is what they will be like they will be asking you for your computer your testing space your id yes you have to send your id guys <laughs> and uh, check they will check you with a short video something right so just click on next then you choose the language so let's choose english next then here have you been have you read okay so just click yes yes then click on next okay so here tick 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 this one tick this one tick this one tick this one also take this one as well and take this one <laughs> then just take take and you know kindly read this one so uh, when I, the id you can bring your passport your driver license anything so for Ghanaians you can send your um, your Ghana card or uh, id voters id or passport Okay, so English, so this is the, the one, the proctor is the one who will be invigilating you. So when you are writing it, I'm someone will be invigilating you, right? So do you want the person to speak uh, Japanese or English? No, English is okay for me. I don't know how to speak Japan. So this is where you are going to book the time for this. Like you are going to book the time. So, uh let's see the time available time let's see what okay so okay so let's see the available time so let's see can can let's see can want to write his exams let's see we are in so today is 7 so we are going to work it on the 8th so king has let's say 20 um, 22nd right so king is booking for the exam and when do king want to take the exam normally i take my exam midnight why because the exams mind you be careful like mind this way the exam you have to um you know, no one should be there right no one should be there when you're writing the exam it should be you and your laptop and there should there shouldn't be so many things in the background so if possible a classroom or me i've been writing it in my room but mostly midnight because they don't want to see anyone there because someone will be watching you so let's see what will happen so 
Ken to be writing his man Tuesday twenty second and by he can he can rebook it anytime, right? So he can rebook. So we are booking for the appointment. You see, so for Ghanaians, the price that you have to pay for the exam exam is thirty nine dollars, right? So it depends. Maybe if you are from US, it depends. If you are from like this, is what you have to pay. But let's proceed. You see, because we joined the petrol training, everything is free for now. Everything is free. So let's see why. So because they have given us a discount. So we need the discount, discount. So we have subtracted this from this because you joined the virtual training, right? So proceed for checkout. So let's click on this. Okay, guys. So when you submit, that means you have to present yourself on that day, that time. So add it to your calendar. And do you mind you checking will be done uh, I think 30 minutes before the paper. So you can see that checking in a uh, checking time uh, is 11 30 p.m. then the uh, the time for the exam will start immediately 12 a.m. right mm -hmm. so that's it so we have to submit for the other and boom guys see your appointment is confirmed and other confirmation containing important uh, exams the information have been sent so you can go to your outlook to find out what's happening whatever they have sent you to be there okay guys so this is how you can boot for your exams so you can add it to your calendar right so you can add it to your calendar so let's see I think that's all. That's all. Well, let me check the outlook. So that's all for this video. Kindly subscribe to this channel so that every bit, every um, everything that be doing you get it right so i think here is it so this is the company so this is the exams info so exams info you can test your system so this all is about right okay so thank you for watching this video see you in the next video bye bye